Hello everybody and welcome to another video inside of my Minecraft survival world. So uh, there's a few things that I want to get done in this video but the main thing is going to be uh, filling up uh, my lake right over here. So yeah I, I made this myself and all that I have left to do is fill it up with water so that's uh, one of the main thing. Uh, for what I'm going to be doing in this video. So how I'm going to do it is I'm going to place blocks on the, um, the, the layer, uh, below a water level. So, uh, if I just go in the, l oh, whoops, uh, so if I just go to look what the water level is, so that would be this level right here so i would place the blocks let's just pretend that the shulker box is what i'm going to be placing down um it, i'm going to place the blocks right here and then i'm going to uh cover all those blocks up with water and then i'm going to break all those blocks and the water will flow down and it, it'll be a uh, very very uh easy but it will take a little bit of time though so the um the block that I'm going to be using is stone bricks because it's easy to get and also can be insta mined if I set up a beacon, which I am going to do. So I'm going to make some uh stone bricks here. So I just want to make sure that I get them in groups of four. So uh so stone bricks, stone bricks, stone bricks. I'm not exactly sure how much I'm gonna need. Um I'll start with maybe just a shulker box full, I think. I think that's pretty reasonable. So, uh, here we go. Now, there's one other thing that I do want to do, which is, uh, make, make some more golden apples. Because, as you can see, my supply is running a little bit low. Um, and also, I mean, my gold supply isn't really the greatest, but I'll, I'll, I'll do what I can. I'll do what I can. So, golden apples, 21 golden apples. That's not bad. But now I'm completely broke on gold, so that, that's not really the greatest thing. Maybe I should go and explore the nether sometime soon. Find some bastions, and then that'll, uh, and then that'll get me quite a lot of gold. And, oh yeah, I do, I <laughs> I do need to set up the beacon. Um, I think I'll do that after I set up the stone bricks and place down the water. I think I'll I'll do that after. Because really, though, I just need it once I uh, uh, play it, break the stone bricks. So, uh, yeah, okay. Okay. Um, I'm going to actually also get a couple water buckets because I, I just want to do this uh, in one without stopping i don't know where i was going that thing with one um okay so that does mean that i'm going to need some uh some emerald blocks do i do i have enough here i think that this is enough i'll just finish off this stack here three stacks i'll i'll make sure that it has this much emeralds in it I'll just, I honestly, I'll just hold the emeralds. There we go. Um, yep, that seems good. And I'm gonna go and start covering this whole entire thing up. I actually, I, I am using replay mod for this because I think that'd just be uh, the best uh, thing to do for the time lapse. So, uh, yeah, let me know if you think it was a good decision or not i'm just i i, I want to make sure that these are uh, at least decent videos you know all right well i'll uh, i'll see you when uh, this entire thing is completely filled up with water then <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, well, it is finally, uh, done. Uh, it, it's filled with water now. It, it's about time. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna bother picking up all, all these stone bricks in, in there, because they'll just spawn in early. I, I already have way too much stone, so, uh, yeah, that's, it's not much, it's not much of my concern. I actually forgot. I need to, uh, I need to take the beacon down. Ah! Oh! I just broke my ender chest with the fortune pickaxe. Ah! <laughs> oh. ah, I'm I'm still a little sick, so I can't I, I can't talk a lot without coughing. But ah, I blame I blame it on the wandering trader. It's just its presence. Uh, it, its presence made me uh think a little weirdly. So. I I blame it on him. It's it's his fault. I don't I don't really yeah I don't really I don't like that guy that that wandering trader guy isn't really my favorite person. But uh, so I'm just gonna put all these random items away here. Do I do I have a uh an eye of ender? I'm gonna assume I don't. Uh, I mean I'll I'll, I'll check just in case. Okay. Uh, I'll take that as a no. Alright. So, I guess I'll just, I guess I'll just put that in here and hold this. I don't know. I, 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 I mean, it wouldn't hurt to have some extra obsidian anyways. So, I'll just put this in here. There we go. So, I'm gonna actually go into the farm room, uh, this, uh, route. Because... I mean, this this farm room here turned out to be something way bigger than I ever could have imagined because I I did this. I thought that this this was all of it. This this was clearly enough. But then I decided to do a sugarcane room above here, which is absolutely massive, by the way, two times the size of my previous one, which was already too big. And, and in this room, surprisingly, took even more work than the, uh, bottom one. <laughs> because, just, the, I, I built an entire lake. <laughs> just, just look at this. I honestly, this is honestly a little bit crazy. I should probably make a map sometime soon of this whole thing. But yeah, I mean, this, this whole area here is just... Very, very different. Wow. I'm just gonna look at it from all the way up here. Okay, the... And yeah, this this entire area used to be a forest. You can tell by the grass color. This whole area used to be a forest, and now it is it is a lake, which I mean... Uh, yeah, well, you, can do, you can do pretty much anything in Minecraft. Pretty much anything. So... Uh, I actually, when I got rid of the sugarcane farm here, I kind of, I got rid of the sugarcane, but not the flat bit. So I'm actually gonna just dig this out a little bit right here, so that it kind of, it looks like nothing was ever here before, because I mean, this, this just looks very, very ugly. Hey, since I have such a good shovel, it shouldn't really take that long at all. Oh, and also, I also, I hope you enjoyed the... The, uh, the replay mod clip, I don't know how it turned out, because cause I'm, I'm recording this while I'm recording the video, but, I mean, I, I hope it turned out alright, and I, and I hope you liked it. Uh, please let me know in the comments if I should, uh, keep doing it for things like time lapses like that. Uh, I, I, I kinda, I've said this before, but I kinda wanted to avoid that, but I feel like times like, uh, doing that... 
uh, filling up the lake with water. It, it was kind of necessary uh, to use replay mod to show that. There's honestly, there's just so many things that I have to do in this world. It's honestly, it's kind of overwhelming me because I, I need to make a room to extend my storage. I need to make a room for maps. Uh, I need to probably a few other things that I can't name off the top of my head. I mean, honestly, the it just I, I I'm I don't know what to do in what order. I should really I should really make a plan. You know, that's that's what I should do. I actually, I got Sharpness 5 in the last video. I mean, I think I got Sharpness 5 a lot a while ago, but uh, the point is, is that I need to uh, put Sharpness 5 onto the sword. 12 levels. Wow, that's really, it's really expensive. All right. I guess I'll, I got Sharpness 5 now. Very, very nice. It's not like it's going to make much of a difference. Oh, I should also, I will, I, I can also put power five on it so how uh, i guess i'll do that too on my bow all right there we go not that expensive there uh okay so i'll put away my buckets now uh what to do next though i still need to do my um my villagers of the day so i, I guess i'll i guess i'll do that so, uh, three weakness potions. Here's the first villager. And so, also, I think... Okay, okay, actually... The villagers seem to be dying so fast. Because, um... They're actually suffocating uh, in the villager breeder. Because there's so many villagers. I haven't actually checked on it on, in quite a while. Because... Honestly, I don't even know if I want to check on it because there's probably too many for my comprehension uh, And it's probably gonna be slightly concerning for both uh, The villagers health and my world's health uh, if I look at how many entities there are you can tell that there are uh, Hundreds of entities. I don't know how big the different the distance is, but if you look over here There's hardly any and then whoo this is the direction of the villager breeder I, I just like to mention that um so so yeah i i think it's it's a slight issue i don't really know how to i think i know how to turn it off actually never mind i don't know but yeah look at how fast it dies okay this is probably a new villager but some of them die really fast because they're just uh, I, I wouldn't even be surprised if a lot of villagers have already died because of entity cramming, but uh, once I get the next villager in uh, all curing and stuff, I'll, I'll look at uh, I'll look at how many villagers there are. All right, now that villager is being sent off. So let's let's look in here. I, I'm a little bit scared if I'm gonna be honest. Um. All right, so I have my little route right up here. So it, they should be in here. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So uh, yeah, you can tell it's kind of a couple villagers, especially in that corner block right there. Oh uh, yeah, I don't think I am. I'm. I have a shortage of villagers. I don't think I do. But yeah, actually, I want to quickly. Oh yeah, this villager here, this villager is in for a heck of a life, let me tell you that much. Or may maybe not, maybe just gonna be in a wooden box the whole time, because, you know, that's probably the fate of most villagers that this thing produces. Only the lucky few will have a purpose. Also, I think I do want to mention that I don't think I've gone strip mining at all. Uh, in, in about half a year or something like that. Because I haven't gone in so long. It's actually a little bit concerning. Because, I mean, I don't really have a need for diamonds. I mean, I'm thinking of getting netherite soon. And I need netherite upgrades. So, I guess I'll need diamonds soon. But, uh, yeah, I haven't really needed diamonds. So, I don't think I've actually gone mining in, uh, quite a while so that that's a that, that's a thing all right i'm not on optifine because i was using replay mod so the lighting's kind of 
uh, I, I've gotten used to the fire uh, when I light mobs up to kind of light the area up. That, that just that just doesn't happen in the real game. Well, in the unmodded version of the game, and I just, I forget. I, I mean, the lighting really should be in the base game. I don't know why it isn't. But that's just, it is how it is. Alright, now I have gotten the three villagers into the library. Now, now this was a very, very good, uh, um, episode for uh, enchantments. Because I got Riptide 3, Lure 3, and Protection 4. Now, Protection 4 is very good because, well, it's Protection 4. I don't know how I haven't gotten it yet, but... Oh uh, yeah, Protection 4 is a super good enchantment. I'm gonna add that to my, uh, chest plate in a moment because it, it has protection, th protection 3. Um, but this was especially good because, uh, this whole area now is complete. Uh, I don't have any other enchantments to do here, so that's pretty nice. We got Riptide here and... So yeah, this this entire section is complete, so we don't have any rails here. We only have rails going into uh, both of those sides, which is uh, nice. And uh, this side is almost done. We only need to get two more because we have a lure now. And how how many how many left do I need? So I have two on that side, and then one, two, three, four, five. Six. So that means that I need eight more villagers. So really though, in the next three videos, I should be done. So that's pretty nice. Uh, so yeah, we got protection four right here. Uh, it could be better, but uh, three emeralds for protection four is actually really, really good. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go over to the storage room and add protection four to my chest plate. Hopefully it's not too expensive. I mean, I doubt it will be, but uh, seven levels, that's not too bad. And now, does that mean that I have full protection for? Yes, it does. Full protection for now. It only took 73 videos. <laughs> okay. So, I'm just going to add uh, these enchantment books to my uh, collection here. Look at it, all these max level books. Isn't this so nice to see? All right. Well, I think I'm going to end off this video right here. So, oh, lo look at the map. That was before there was a whole lake there. Yeah, I'm just going to end off the video by admiring the lake. Wow. Look at this. This took so long. Why did I do this? And why is there just wandering traders absolutely everywhere? I should probably look at their uh, trades. Is it anything good? No, not really. It's not like it matters anymore anyway since he's dead now. Alright. Well, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. And I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye.